Lobby Tools, Florida's legislative intelligence company. Subscribe today to Florida's leading policy, budget, and campaign tracking service. Request a free trial today at LobbyTools.com. Florida Democrats had hoped to call the legislature back to the Capitol for a special session to talk background checks and red flag laws. We would like to strengthen those laws and allow families to also petition the courts in addition to law enforcement. But a special session requires three-fifths support in both chambers. At close of business on Monday, 19 out of 40 senators and 62 out of 120 representatives had said no to a special session on guns. The failure came as no surprise to NRA lobbyist Marion Hammer. They simply wanted to create an opportunity for political grandstanding. But now gun control advocates are shifting their attention to Washington. Tell Marco Rubio and Mitch McConnell to stand up to the gun lobby. The ad, set to appear in Fort Myers and Miami, target U.S. Senator Marco Rubio and Rick Scott. At least one Florida congressman believes it's not the laws that are broken, but enforcement. We already have laws that say this guy shouldn't own guns. This guy needs to be Baker Act. And, they, and it isn't even being done. So we don't have we don't have a measurable place to start with the laws that we actually have on the books. And while gun control advocates hope to change the minds of Florida's U.S. lawmakers, state Democrats still plan to file gun control legislation for the regular session in January. The Senate president has promised a thorough discussion. Reporting at the state capitol, I'm Jake Stofan.